guys what's up it is thursday january 19th i um <clears throat> it is 9 58 i have a 10 o'clock facial so this morning i dropped Kamora off to school so now i'm about to run in here and get a facial and then i was gonna try to go to fort lauderdale but actually i'm gonna go tomorrow because they're gonna be pouring the foundation tomorrow for one of the houses um so I'm going to go back home because actually I have a furniture and delivery coming. So let me go in here and get my facial. And, um, yeah. So I got two minutes. One minute to get in there. Alright. Alright, I just left from having a facial. I was having some furniture delivered earlier this week. And they canceled my delivery. They changed it to today. So I was supposed to be meeting a friend of mine for breakfast but I'm gonna try to go home and make the delivery be there when they deliver the stuff so yeah and after I get a facial I always feel like my face look like worse until later on that night anyway yeah I'm redoing my bedroom so for this side of my bedroom because it's really big um this rug is gonna go like under the bed when the bed gets here the new bed a white bed and i'm gonna have this rug on this side of the room and then another rug on the side of the room where i have the sectional um so yeah i just opened up this rug i just got it opened it up everything it is the exact color that I wanted it to be, but it to be a little terracotta, but actually I like this color better. I just want my room to be really warm, earth tones, creams, whites, but I knew I wanted the rug to have some color. So that is where we are. This rug is 10 by 14, so once I push it under the bed up until about right there, and then it should come to probably about right here in the room, 10 feet. Yeah, that's a label. Monday. Yeah. All right, so this house we doing. 
going to pour the concrete on Monday. We pouring the concrete over there already. They waiting on the third truck to come. Third truck, three and four. Coming to deliver to pour the foundation because we pouring foundation today for that house. And then on Monday for this house because today's Friday. And as you can see, I think I've showed you all this before. Another house. This is the plastic. The wire. All the little steel. It's wet underneath there because it was a termite spray gun. So, you know, you have to spray for termites twice in the construction process. Once before you put the plastic down. And then uh, once after the house is completed. Yeah. somebody and ask me he's talking about am I buying the house and right now we're gonna need about five trucks each truck is 10 yards 10 yards each good how, how are you yeah yeah two two of them five of them really because I'm three other three other ones so neither I'm the developer no uh-uh yeah. 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 Uh-uh. Nah. These will be so... Yeah, so that's just one of the workers. You know, people always assume when I'm on site, since I be the only woman out here, that I'm the person who gonna buy the house or whatever. But he, he just asked me. You gonna be buying this house? Uh, no. Not smooth. Period. 
y'all it is so hot out here today and i did not bring a lemon city t-shirt no nothing Devaney, I am out here live at the properties in Fort Lauderdale, at two of the lots in Fort Lauderdale that are right next to each other. Let me flip the screen. All right, this house right here, we're going to be pouring, um, we're going to be pouring the foundation on. Monday, but we're pouring the foundation today on this one. Two trucks have already delivered uh, concrete. You can see. Let me go over there. Anyway, wait. While I'm over here, this this house, as you can see, we have the plastic, the wire. If you look real close at the plastic, you'll see it's wet because of termite spray. Um, had to have been done before we put the plastic, the wire, the steel, all that. Um, and this is how it looks when you're prepping it for um, all of the plumbing. The roof has been uh, put in. And this is how it looks before you pour the concrete for the foundation. 
Then, once you start pouring, this is what it's looking like. They pumping in the concrete. And then they gotta smooth it as they go. So this right here is, is the, uh, so when the next truck comes, I'll show you how they pumping it in. And you see he's smoothing it out. Um, and so they, you pump and smooth, pump and smooth, pump and smooth. So, and right now, we're gonna need about five trucks. These trucks is 10 yards, 10 yards each. Good, Hi, how are you? Yeah, yeah, two two of them, five of them really, because I'm three other three other ones. So, neither I'm the developer. No, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, nah. These will be so. person who gonna buy the house or whatever but he don't know nah, I'm the owner nope so you'll see once the truck gets out here I'll come back on live and you'll see that they'll start pumping in concrete and they'll be smoothing and pumping smoothing and pumping need about five trucks these trucks is 10 yards 10 yards each good Hi, how are you yeah yeah two two of them five of them really because i'm three other three other ones so neither i'm the developer no uh-uh yeah 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 uh-uh, nah. These will be so... Yeah, so that's just one of the workers. You know, people always assume when I'm on site, since I be the only woman out here that I'm the person who gonna buy the house or whatever. But he don't...